Hello guys and welcome to another interesting episode of Madrid My DNA, the home of everything Madridistas. As we discuss you through Real Madrid's latest and important update. Kickstarting with today's agenda, Real Madrid midfield maestro and praises from Paris Saint-Germain and former Real Madrid winger as he claims he only gets better. We are going to be discussing you through that on this episode as we move forward. And shortly after that, we will quickly turn our attention to the next agenda as Real Madrid may look to sell 24 years old star Fran Garcia if top target Alfonso Davies arrives in the summer, report claim. We are going to be discussing you through that on this episode as we move forward. So please stay tuned right up to the end. Do not forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Turn on your notification bells so you do not miss on our next update. Tony Cruz has simply been sensational for Real Madrid this season. At 34 years of age, and with younger names all around him, many expected the German to take a step back in prominence, but that has not been the case. 25 match days into La Liga, the midfield maestro has scored one goal and provided seven assists for Los Blancos. He is also in many ways, the heart of Real Madrid set up and one of the team's most important resources, both in attacking and defensive transitions. Speaking to a Bleachers report earlier this week, former Real Madrid star Marco Asensio praised his former teammate and insisted that the veteran was aging like fine wine. Tony Cruz every year looks like it could be his last, but he only gets better and better. I think he's a player who will play as long as he wants. As it stands, the German star's contract at Real Madrid runs out this summer. Los Blancos are working hard to secure a renewal, although the financial decisions will lie with the player himself. Based on his sensation and importance in the team, he will get to make the final decision. If recent reports are to be believed, however, Cruz has decided to stay for another year in what is a massive boost for Real Madrid. While talks over his retirement are eternal, Tony Cruz stole the headlines last month when he announced his return to the German national team for the upcoming European Championships. His decision to participate in international football has come and come out of retirement itself speaks volumes about the player's mentality and confidence right now. If anything, the Merengues should breathe a sigh of relief after the player's big decision for it only lays the foundation for another guaranteed season at the club. In fact, the player made a point to convey to the management that the national team duty would have no impact on his commitment duties to the club, clearly showing his priorities in order. So I haven't discussed and concluded with that, 
we are going to quickly turn our attention to the next agenda. At Real Madrid, men look to sell 24 years old star if top target arrives in the summer. Real Madrid are leaving no stone unturned in their bid to assemble an even stronger squad for the upcoming campaign. Kylian Mbappe and Alfonso Davies are in the club's top target in that regard. For the two new signings will be regular starters and bona fide difference makers on the field for Los Blancos. The latter in particular arrives to reinforce a position where none of Carlo and Salothi's current options are convincing. Fran Garcia and Ferland Mendy have both had their hiccups at the left-back position for Real Madrid, leaving the position open for Davies to take over. As revealed by Marca, Davies' arrival next season will jeopardize Garcia's importance in the team for the Canadian will be the manager's first choice by a mile. Moreover, Ancelotti is said to be in favor of renewing Mendy, implying that Garcia will pa practically be the third choice. Come summer, Garcia could thus be sold if the club receive an offer that they can make money of. Considering that they shelled out 5 million euros last summer for his incorporation, any offers not of that mark could do the job. In 18 appearances and 11 starts in La Liga this season, the 24 years old has provided 4 assists for Los Blancos. Interestingly, he has started just one of Real Madrid's last six games across all competitions. As revealed earlier this week, Real Madrid reached a verbal agreement with Alfonso Davies, an agreement with Bayern Munich over a transfer fee could be a difficult proposal, however, as such, it is unclear if Los Blancos will make the move for Davies this summer at a, subside, a subsidized fee or wait until next year when the player will be a free agent. Garcia's future, needless to say, depends on their plans of action on Davies' front. So having discussed and concluded with that, we have come to the end of this interesting episode. Thanks for following us right up to the end. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Turn on your notification bells so you do not miss on our next update. See you next time and a very big Hala Madrid to us all.